Hi everyone, Marin here for Sunny Studio. I'm back with the magical slimline card showcasing the Art on a Limb die set. I used that set to create an enchanted tree and once again I built a custom sentiment using words from different sets. So this is the Out on a Limb die set. I picked three fairies and the word magical from Garden Fairy. The butterflies coordinating dice from Bunnyville. The clouds coordinating dice from Balloon Rides to create foliage. The word kisses from Harvest Mice. The words sending you and wishes from Happy Harvest. A flower die from the pristine poinsettia die set and another one from the botanical backdrop die set. The Chloe alphabet die set to make the word fairy and a paper from the Flirty Flowers paper pack. So I started by stamping three fairies and three wands using extreme black ink by my favorite things and I colored them using purples, aquas and pinks.
So I will cut my images using the coordinating dies. Next, I move down to the background. I cut an 8.5 by 3.5 inches crystal panel. I taped a hill stencil at the bottom and then I created a night sky using blueprint sketch, cheap sapphire and black suit oxidings. I wanted the tree to match the fairies with bold colors, so that's why I kept the background pretty neutral and dark. So I applied the colors from the lightest at the bottom to the darkest towards the top of the panel. And as always, I went back and forth with my blending tools to get a nice result. Next, I added a whole lot of texture and details to make this night sky all shiny with many, many stars. Once the top part was dry, I moved the stencil and the night sky was already quite busy so I kept the bottom part simple and I just added tumble glass oxiding on that section. Next I created the enchanted tree and I first cut all the pieces out of white cardstock just to get a general idea of how it would look. So I built that tree and then I cut all the pieces out of colored cardstock, starting with the trunk that I cut out of a light grey cardstock. And I added a little bit of shadows on the edges using these tracings. And I will do the same for all the other elements, colored cardstock and then these tracings. Once all the pieces were done, I assembled everything. I cut more trunks that I glued together to bring dimension. And I attached the elements on the panel using a mix of liquid glue and foam squares.
Before adding the fairies, I wanted to create the sentiment. I cut some letters out of a pink cardstock to make the word fairy. And I stamped some words to finally read sending you fairy kisses and magical wishes. At the end, I stamped a few grass sprigs on the bottom part using blueprint sketch oxiding. I added white details and highlights on the images and die cuts. And finally, I added some clear glitter on the fairy's wings. And that's it, we have a magical scene with this tall enchanted tree and cute fairies. And I hope that you like it. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Have a very nice day. Bye.